You have entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live every week. Turn on notifications to never miss an episode. Now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Hey, 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 plumbing pros, welcome to the 305th episode of Potty Talk Live. Hey there, I'm your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber, along with my co-host, the lovely Laura, where we're talking the business of plumbing. Mm-hmm, That's right. Are. How to grow a successful, self-sustaining, and profitable plumbing business. All right? That's a word. One that works for you, mm-hmm. you not for it. How's that sound? All right. Living Wouldn't you love king. that? Well, that's what we're all about mm-hmm. here. So welcome. Welcome to the hey, program everybody. here. Hey, looking forward to tonight. We are. We got a great... We this, are. Yeah, you are. We are. <laughs> all right. It is, uh, it is the first of a four-part series. <gasps> Four-part okay. series? On hiring. Mm. Okay. Mm-hmm. In fact, we're going to be talking about, uh, you know, how to train, you know, once you get the guys on, how to train, mm-hmm. uh, how, to, how to retain, mm-hmm. how to fire. Okay. Mm. Everyone's favorite topic there, how to fire. Mm-hmm. Okay. We get to that mm-hmm. in that, that process. Mm-hmm. But tonight we're going to be talking about the hiring process. Okay. Okay. About hiring, what you're looking for. So right. we'll get, in, okay. get into it in just a moment Perfect. here. All right. Yeah. So how's everyone doing? Hey, All you know right. the routine here. Yeah. If you're watching live, type live in the comments. Let's see what we got here. Let us Who's know you're watching oh, live. Ooh, Jim Lowry says, just had to lay off my brother today. That was ooh. probably, I know, it probably well, hurt. Okay, was it a layoff? <laughs> or, hey, are, or are you softening it up? Or, yeah. All right. Right. So which, yeah. But did you have to fire? Because we, we've, we've heard of that as well. So, yes. guys. Um, let's see. I fired my son a few times. Yes. <laughs> so did I, my brother. Yeah. So did I. And finally it stopped. Okay. Hey, BB's joining join. us. Mr. All right. Um, BB's in the uh, house. Uh, bit frost, bite frost. All right. Cool. Good to have you here, yes. brother. Good to see you. But yeah. Type live. If you're, you're watching live, if you're watching the replay, let us know you watch the replay by typing hey, replay. And if you're listening to the podcast, you know what to do. Just keep on listening. Listen, All hi, right. Man. Good to see so, yes. So today, weather in sunny Florida. Hey, Christine. Oh. In sunny southwest Florida. It's like where it's 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 cold. I got my, I got my little so my hot chocolate here. It's cold here. You know? It is so cold. Blowy. Okay, and I know everybody in north is going, yeah, yeah, whatever. But it's wow. really bad. That's why we moved here. <laughs> no, it is That's so Jimmy bad. Jimmy Buffett's full of crap. crap. I know. You know? And um, we have clients here visiting from out of town. Yes, just had a great dinner with we him did. and their family. Yes, John Cute and Kelly. family, John and Kelly. Hatch out of Oregon. Oregon. Lynn Bitten Plumbing. Lynn Bitten Plumbing. Yes, yep. very fun. Um, got to hang out with them for a little bit. And they came to sunny Florida for wonderful weather. And yep. Uh, not so much today, but thought, it's supposed to be better rest of the week. Yes. But anyway. BB says, talking about hiring plumbers, mm-hmm. how can people com- complain that there are no plumbers to hire yet? Not all back when, when someone asks for not a job. Not back when someone asks for a job. Yeah. Mm. Yep. Okay. okay we'll we'll get we, we're going to be talking about all talking, that kind of yes. stuff. Yes. All that kind of stuff, right? Well, well I'm, just, I'm just trying to warm up here. I know. Under the, the lights of the studio. Oh, we, just, we came in. We actually, like I said, we were out to dinner with uh, yes. you know, some friends here that are in from out of town. Mm-hmm. Christine yeah. liked my hair. Yeah. Oh, very nice. Yeah, I like your hair. You just look nice, baby. <laughs> Thank you. It's and all she winter. would know. Yeah. She's, yeah, she's a professional. Yeah, she is. Mm-hmm, so. uh, professional what? <laughs> Sorry, Christine. No, I said, no, All right. No. Okay. Hey, um, Bosa's live with the GM. With your G- hey there. All right. Cool. Good. Welcome. Yes. Okay. Um, We're what? just trying to warm up here. Yes. Okay. It's so bad. It's yeah. really, really bad. But we, I guess we do have so, a question, though, right? But it's all warm and fuzzy here being with all you guys. <laughs> <It> okay. <is. laughs> what are plumbers looking for in an employer? Mm. Okay. Yeah, let us think? know. Plumbers are looking for, and where, or what, what do you hear from? Yeah, what, what do you think uh, mm-hmm. your plumbers are looking for when, when they're coming looking for a job? Mm-hmm. You can so think about know. that as well as what were you when you used to be a plumber at another shop? Which and says, yeah, were, cold, hot, okay. 24 degrees <laughs> here. I know, I know, but it's cold. Um, but it's a dry cold there. It's wet here. <laughs> <laughs> no, the cold did not miss up. Well, maybe yeah. it did, but we didn't miss it. Um, eight Steve, oh, Eight no, no pity. Yeah. Right. Ooh, <laughs> that's just wrong. Oh. All right. We got to top that. Come on. What I, um, it's I know, cold. It's cold. Here. <laughs> right. And the waves, it's the real windy, and the that's waves right. are like really high. Like if you, you look at surf. the waves, look scary. I know. I know. Very dangerous. Okay. Josh says money. Money? Okay, you, money, think, money. you think so? Mm-hmm. Okay. We got money. That's what uh, they're looking for. Looking for money? Think so. Yeah. You think so? Mm-hmm. Who okay. else, guys? And there, All right, let us else? know. Come on, yeah, let come us on. know. What are your plumbers looking for? People that you interview, or e- again, even when you were 
or a plumber looking for a job, what were you looking Les- for? Leslie hey, says, Leslie. hey. Yeah, this hey, I just saw that. Hey. Hey. Right back hey. at you. Hey. <laughs> mm-hmm. um, right. Well, are you going to answer the question? Or? All right. All right. BV says, yeah, you don't know Coles. You live in northern Minnesota. Mm. I mean, right. That's probably true. Okay, here's a great time to say sign right. up for um, getting a text message when we go live with the current state of social media right now. Um, yep. You never know. You never know. Um, <laughs> you never know if we're going to be around. I'm not going. I'm we're not, not going there. So, but best way to get notified when we go live is to get a text message from us saying we are going live. So just yes. type text in the comments right now, and you will get notified via text. So you never miss an episode of Potty Talk Live. Um, wherever Danny says we are. Culture. Danny Looking says, for culture. That's good. Culture. Um, Steve also says Josh PTO. Security. Some oh, security. That's good, Josh. Oh, okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. Good. Looking for stability. Let's. Yep. Stability. Um, okay. Let's see. Steve says PTO. PTO. Yes, and that's good. You guys, that's something to really think about. Um, and I think when Jessica Jambroni was on for yeah. Applicant Pro, she mentioned that as well. That um, time off means a lot these days right. um, to guys with families. They want to have time off to be able to take time off either go fishing right. or hang with their family, go on vacation. PTO is very important. Yes. Um, Christine, we were talking today about. Um, what are some good incentives? Gym membership, barber haircut, monthly massage. <laughs> monthly massage. We don't. Yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. That is that Christine? That. She is. Yeah, a, it was Christine. She is the professional, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> um, we did. We did. Um, we didn't do monthly massages, but we did do um, a massage once. Um, yeah. Patrick, Filipino <laughs> boss. <laughs> They're looking for a Filipino boss. boss. Yes. <laughs> well, there's not many of those. So, yep. um, Dub says security. security. Mm-hmm. Okay, we're going to get in. I'll, we'll, we'll discuss all that. Okay. We'll get into that. Mm-hmm. Well, that's what we're going to This is um, the first of a four part series. Mm-hmm. We're talking about, about the whole hiring process. That's, that's right. um, you know, something that most of everyone's really interested in about how, how do I hire? Mm-hmm. You know, how, how do I train? What's the training process? Mm-hmm. How do I retain? You know, and how do I fire? That's mm-hmm. the big one. How are you it scared? Like you know? my brother. Right. Really, Jim, I don't know if Jim posted back. Did you really have to fire your brother or lay him off? Be interested to, and you to probably see. probably should it'd probably be the best thing ever happened to yeah. your plumbing business sad i'll just say it mm-hmm. okay um uh, demand security with decent um hours and pay insurance and clean trucks yep mm-hmm. all right. those things but mm-hmm. but this whole hiring process is a big you know it's it's it is the asset i mean you'll hear me talking about this there's there's two there's two assets that you constantly focused on mm-hmm. okay and that's one is of course your customers certainly okay and the other is your plumbers, okay. Without the, your plumbers, without the plumbers, you can't take care of the customers, mm-hmm. okay. As you do it all. Sadly, we do. We kind of forget about the plumbers. We mm-hmm. just kind of focus on everything else. Forget forget about the plumbers, mm-hmm. okay. So we hear, mm-hmm. I hear this all the time. Well, I just can't, well, can't find any good guys. Mm-hmm. There just aren't any good guys out there. Just can't can't find anyone. Can't. Well, of course not. Right when you're looking for a guy, there's never anyone available, mm-hmm. okay. Right. It's been that way for thirty years, by just the way. Just thirty. Yeah, my whole my whole oh your whole person. plumbing career right. It's, there's never been there's never been enough plumbers. Mm-hmm. The trade has always been you know everyone's always going to school whatever whatever the excuses we're using today those excuses have been around forever. Mm-hmm. Okay, so it's the same stuff. Okay, okay. Right. in fact there's just there never is guys when right when you need right them when you need right. right just like any other industry by the way. Okay, if you're Ooh. if you're in software mm-hmm. and you're looking for a good you know software engineer or whatever mm-hmm. they're just not available right when you need them I mean, even though even though that's a popular thing today. Right. Right. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. Sorry, right. I just know that comment. What? comment that Aaron said that he's getting the notifications 12 to 18 minutes after the show starts. Well, well we can't have that, Aaron. Heads are going to roll. That's right. That's not it's good. It's a conspiracy. Facebook, <laughs> see, I told you, that's uh, already <laughs> after us, okay? But it it starts. Facebook. Right, okay. So oh. uh, they're, but they're behind everything. Okay, day. thank you for letting us know, Aaron. Okay. Appreciate that. All right. That's not good. No, it's not. Hmm. Don't have to hire someone else. Yeah. Someone did get us fresh water this time, though. Yeah, so. that's why this is like. This is fresh water. This is fresh H2O. Okay. <laughs> what movie is that from? Come on. All right. <laughs> it's going to be sad if you guys know that. All right. I'm kind of embarrassed that I even know that. I am kind of embarrassed right. for you. Okay. Okay. But the hiring thing is a big deal. Mm-hmm. Okay. So tonight we want to discuss really how what we are looking for when we are hiring. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. In that process. Okay. So um, shall we get at it? Uh, I think so. I'm okay. Ready. All right. You oh, ready? Uh-huh. So Follow we're hiring. Mm-hmm. All right. Point number one. You ready? <laughs> there it is. It ain't about plumbing. Okay. Oh my gosh, everybody's hey. like, shut up. Stop saying hey, that. I want to drive. That's, that, that is, that's going to be on my tombstone. Oh. Okay. It ain't about plumbing. It's not. Th- this, is the, this is the head game part. If I, if I can get just this, this something across, mm-hmm. okay, okay. That this is my, 
it's your it's your um, I guess my your manifesto my, my, right <laughs> it ain't about plumbing okay so even when you're hiring a guys it ain't about plumbing mm. it ain't about plumbing <laughs> What's it about? okay if I have to hear another guy and that's what I go okay, on about how go. you know you run these guys through this whole plumbing test mm. you know and all this kind of stuff and mm. ask them all this plumbing questions and all that mm. that that's a waste of time okay okay all right it, it ain't about plumbing. By the way, if they've already said they know plumbing, okay, if they say they know plumbing, take the word for it, they know plumbing, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, because no one just wakes <laughs> up in the morning and wants to come apply for a job for you because they want to be, you know. Right. Okay. And if you hire them and they really didn't know anything about plumbing, that's going to become pretty apparent. It becomes, right. You, come on. When you interview guys, you guys get to tell you they know plumbing, right, they tell you they can do this and do that. Mm -hmm. And, you know, they're putting on their best face and they're kind of pushing a little bit. You know within two weeks what they know and don't know, okay? <laughs> but it ain't about plumbing, mm -hmm. okay? So through this whole process, mm -hmm. even, the, even the process it's, itself, we, we get into this, is it's, it doesn't do, it ain't about plumbing. So we don't need to test them on plumbing. We ain't going to need to talk plumbing. Um, you're not going to show them the plumbing truck or not be out at the plumbing truck, all that kind of stuff, or well, on the plumbing job. What do you mean? Or, during the interview process? Right. Okay. E even the guys, um, you know, some guys, and I, I, I get this, and I hate to say it because even some of my guys do this, hmm. they do them on a, they, they bring them on a test run. Hmm. You know, mm -hmm. come work for me free for a couple of days. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. You're not a fan. No, not a fan of yeah. that at all. Because mm -hmm. you're making it about making it about plumbing. Okay. Okay. And that's also something that that slows down. When we talk about this idea of scaling. Okay. That slows down the whole process. Okay. So so it ain't about plumbing. So about there, there's plumbing. a lot lot here because mm -hmm. we um, a lot of guys we want to make it look like we're going to be buddies and we're going to be friends and and I want to make <laughs> this the best guy and I'm going to take care of him and we're going to ride off in the sunset together and all this happy thought. That's why we want to do all this stuff this stuff together and make sure everything is right mm -hmm. when you need to look at it the other way where they're an asset okay they're an asset and so if you bring the asset on if it works great if it doesn't you move on mm -hmm. okay it ain't about plumbing it's mm -hmm. about the business okay what if they're bragging about how they learned plumbing as as, as RV, RV like RV like recreational vehicle <laughs> <Yeah. tanks>. right. <laughs> <laughs> then that's your gut. I mean, <laughs> okay. Strike one. All right. It's all about. Hi, Allie. It's all about Tell the attitude. Oh, okay, we're getting to that part. Okay. Don't, don't jump the shark. Okay. Yet. Well, well, this le <laughs> leans into point two. Let's just go ahead and Let's head that way. There. Okay. Thanks, point Allie. number two. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Character matters most. Mm -hmm. Okay. And that was Allie, part of a PPC plumbing power couple. Okay. I'm pretty sure. Was that the, the wife? Team, wife. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's probably why that came across very intelligent. Okay. <laughs> Guys, I'm sorry. All right, but that's <laughs> that, that's why the girls why. call themselves the brains. Yes. Okay, because we want to make it about the plumbing, and I hear fight with this with the guys all the time about the plumbing. The plumbers are never going to be as good as you. Okay, no, no one's ever going to plumb as good as you. Mm -hmm. Period. But we hold the, these guys up to this standard and this plumbing uh, this plumbing standard. Mm -hmm. All right, and so that just that's what's holding you back. Right. Okay, no one's going to plumb as good as you. It's okay. True. Think yeah. about all the guys that you worked with at whatever shop you came from. Right? right. More than likely, you were the best. Right. Right. Um, so, and you're the one that went out and started your own business. So the other guys, not so much. Right. So this is why I'm trying to get over this hump, and I hit it. You know, I, I keep hitting on that fact, and this is important even in the hiring side of things. It ain't about plumbing. Yeah, it's about character. Okay. When it comes to hiring your guys. You want to hire on character. So what's a good um, character matters most. Okay. So what's what's a good? So we're interviewing somebody, right? Okay. So what are you looking for as far as character? Well, first of all, in the character, I got there, there's I'm interviewing there's, you, by right. The way. You're interviewing. <laughs> you see that? You yeah. Know. Hey, baby. Okay, that's a character flaw. <laughs> that's a character flaw. Okay. Like, what did someone say? One of our clients said that they set up yeah. a Zoom um, interview with a potential client and had the wife do the first initial um, interview, which is key. Which is key and and good and correct. Um, but their the applicant said, "Ooh, I didn't know I was going to be interviewed by such a pretty lady." F. Gone. <laughs> right. right. Okay. Like, really? You did not just say Carmen's, that. Carmen's appearance um, and hygiene. hygiene. Good. Carmen. Right. Yeah, exactly. If they walk in and they're all stinky and well, that's, they're stuffing their beard. and That's why we like to do, you know, we want, um, certainly if you're a plumbing power couple, have the wife interview. Yes. You don't need to talk. We ain't talking plumbing. So, so I don't need to know plumbing. You don't need to ask plumbing questions because it ain't right. about plumbing. Yep. Okay. It mm -hmm. ain't about plumbing. Mm -hmm. Even when it gets to you guys, it ain't about plumbing. 
Yes. Okay. But we're going back to character. So what are you looking oh, for as character? character. I know, Sorry. I know, I'm hitting that home. Because no, no. <laughs> that's one of the biggest hurdles to get over, and it's holding you back in your plumbing business because mm-hmm. you're making it about plumbing. As soon as you let the plumbing go, now I'm not saying that you don't have don't hire guys that, that can do the plumbing right. and, 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 and buy code and do quality work. Right. That that goes like, well, 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 of course you can dunk the ball. You're you're 11 foot tall. <laughs> I know. Okay, so Shaquille stop. Shaquille O'Neal's like, I dunked the ball. Look, okay, no, I expect, I expect you to dunk the ball, okay? <laughs> don't, don't come over here and look for a hug, mm-hmm. okay? All right? <laughs> There's no hug. All right, coming. okay. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay. So character, what are you looking so, for in character? So character. Well, the char- character matters most. So that's mm-hmm. why we like to have go through um, the the wife first, okay? Mm-hmm. Or the CSR. First, or a CSR, a female, mm-hmm. female. okay? Mm-hmm. Because we're looking for the creep factor, mm-hmm. okay? The creep factor is huge. Guys, you don't pick up on the cute, um, creep factor. Guys don't, girls okay? do. Now, now, we're talking again here. This, has to, this is for residential service plumbers. Correct. Okay. Yep, Alex. Okay, mm-hmm. there we go. This is for residential service plumbers. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. Had, Had a guy up. show up in a <laughs> Sesame Street t-shirt recently. Okay, this is all given insight into character. Right. Okay. All right. Probably. But we, we have that first interview. We're checking out. And we like to, to interview with a female first mm-hmm. because we can see what their body language is. Women can pick up on stuff. Yes. Women have a seventh sense, an extra sense, <laughs> or a sixth Six sense. sense. Sixth sense. Uh-huh. Okay. And they may have seven senses. Seven they probably have eight. Right. <laughs> but they have an extra sense, mm-hmm. okay, that us guys just don't have. It's, right. it's the creep factor. Mm-hmm. Okay, so they can tell whether they're being checked out, not just the initial, oh, you know, but, but constantly being checked out, mm-hmm. um, being hit on, being talked to in a different way. And if they'll right. do that in an interview setting, they'll do that to Mrs. Jones, you, okay, yeah, your customer, sure. okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you, you want to cut that out mm-hmm. right away. Yeah, so that's the character thing. Right. Also, it was mentioned about appearance and that kind of, those mm-hmm. kinds of things are important. Mm-hmm. Well. You know, the women do a better job of picking up on that as well. Because we smell. We have a better sense of smell. Better sense of smell. <laughs> but, and I've also had, we, I mean, we had guys that made it through that, that had gauges and, and tats. Mm-hmm. So it's not a matter of just, whether well, you, you know, tats and that kind of stuff. Not but anymore. it's their apparent, their attitude, their right. parents. Do they hold mm-hmm. themselves in a clean right. manner? Right. And are they clean? Right. Hands clean. Right. That's that a big kind, deal. That kind yeah, of stuff. Hands. Okay, mm-hmm. so if they've showed up in an interview <coughs> where they're, you know, mm-hmm. and, and they're dressed mm-hmm. in Sesame, whatever. Sesame Street gear. Right. Mm. Okay, Matt. Hi, Matt Delney with the twins. Yeah, look mm-hmm. at that. Oh, All right. Know, so sweet. Um, should I hire a green guy? No. Mm-mm. One or two years of experience. Yeah. Okay, which leads. Right. Yeah, especially right now. That, right. Depending on the size of your company, the age of your company, there may be times where you do hire a green I, I don't know. So, wait till you have at least 10 guys. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, for guys mm-hmm. that are building, we're talking about getting you out of the truck and we're building here. You want guys that have worked in other shops, mm-hmm. uh, other service shops. Right. So that's why I say the plumbing, don't, if, if they have, they've worked at Roto-Rooter or whatever another service ben company Franklin. is, Ben Franklin, mm-hmm. or the other, you know, larger uh, system service shop in town, okay, mm-hmm. and they've worked there for a couple years. And you know that shop does, you know, they do drain cleaning, they, they fix plumbing, they install water heaters, mm-hmm. you know, they, they do, do all, all the they do all this stuff. stuff. Mm-hmm. If the guy has worked at that shop and it says he knows the stuff and he's applying for you, mm-hmm. he knows plumbing. Right. Okay. You'll find out in a couple of weeks what he doesn't know, mm-hmm. that kind of a thing. Right. Okay, but mm-hmm. the odds are he knows plumbing. Mm-hmm. So to take him through the drill, what would you do if you had a gas line with this kind of volume? And well, you know, it's, <laughs> it's a waste of time. Mm-hmm. Okay, mm-hmm. all right. Okay. So what take the word for it. Yeah. So what are the characters? It's one of my pet pets. Uh, it <laughs> okay. Hey, because it, cause, cause it hold, because it holds guys back. Here in a second. Okay. Mm-hmm. But character matters most. You want to hire on that character. Right. Okay. What other character? Are there any other character things you can look for in an interview? Well, by the time they would get, if they do move it and make it past the creep factor. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. So when it, when it does come to you, by the way, we want to make it where it's uh, like a victory to be able to come talk to you. Yes. So you if they make it past the, the um, gatekeeper, right, right, which is going to be the CSR, the, the wife, whatever. They're the gatekeeper. Right. Um, if they pass the, the creep factor test and can identify some good character traits that they have, they're going to move on to the king. Right. Mm-hmm. And so even when they got a chance, by the time they got a chance to talk, talk with me, okay, um, I didn't ask any. In fact, the only plumbing question I asked was, you know, what, and I did this to find out character, mm-hmm. what plumbing do you hate to do? And mm-hmm. I'd say it with a smile. Mm-hmm. 
What plumbing do you hate to do? Well, I don't hate any plumbing. I so, love all plumbing. Okay, you're a liar. Right. <laughs> okay. Failure. Well, well, normally you would get, well, I, there's, you know, they would. Drain work. Good character, or, you would have something. Well, I really don't like whatever, but mm -hmm. I know we, I do it. You know, right. I know it's just part of the job, and mm -hmm. I do I get it. But some will rather go into, well, I can't do crawl spaces, and right. I can't lift a water heater over 40, 40 gallons. You, you'd be surprised blah, 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 blah. once you ask. Some guys just don't, they just, because it shows they have no character, right? Right. So they don't realize really what's happening, that they're in an interview process and they're mm -hmm. talking to the boss. So they start telling you everything, <laughs> in their words, what they won't do. Right. Okay, what they won't do. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we look for that. So why don't we just narrow down, what will you do? Right. <laughs> that, so that was the only plumbing question I ever mm -hmm. asked. Yeah. Okay, that I ever asked. Mm -hmm. After I got past the, you know, back in the first part of the days, I, you know, early days, I ran through the plumbing test or whatever. That's why I can tell you it doesn't matter, okay? All right, it doesn't matter. They're going to tell you what they know, you know, that they know everything or whatever. And, you know, you're not going to be able to ask them all the plumbing stuff that, that you want to. You know, so it's, it's silly to walk through that. All what the are plumbing some of the stuff. fun questions that you like to ask? See, see gonna... reeling me in? Reeling me in? Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. What were well, they? Well, one of my really okay, 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 really, you want to know? <laughs> well, I had a one of the th things I loved asking because it, again, this is about character, mm -hmm. and you want to put them back on their heels. I want mm -hmm. I want to kind of put them off and see how they react when things don't go the way they think it's going. Right. Like it often happens on a job, right? Mm -hmm. Not okay. Funny. So how how do they behave? What well, what happens? So I would ask a question like, um, if you could live during a different time period, when would that be, and what would you do? <laughs> And often I had to ask that question a couple mm. times because it was like, what? What? Uh, was it? There's no, we're, we're not talking plumbing? <laughs> you know, what's that have to do with plumbing kind mm -hmm. of a thing? But that's exactly what I wanted to, I wanted to put them, you know, make them uncomfortable mm -hmm. and see how, see how they respond, how, how they react. Do, mm -hmm. they, do they shut down? Do they Do they, they kind of get a little light about it do and they, think it's right, funny? Right. Well, yeah. How do they? How do they respond? Right. Are they able to think on their feet? Exactly. Yeah. So those are always fun questions. Right. Mm -hmm. So the character character is the big deal. <laughs> sorry, guys. Okay. That's a bit of a cough. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you do. I do. All right. You come down with the COVID. <laughs> no, All right. I'm not coming okay. down with the COVID. Um, okay, we'll answer that question here in just a minute from Arthur Thompson, who offers the best sales training. I think it'd be the million dollar plumber. But you don't need sales training. Sucker. Okay, no, okay, no sales training. You don't need sales training. You need service training. Need service training. That's right. Okay. Through the million dollar. You don't plumber. need. A, you don't need to be a salesman, because mm. you guys, you guys aren't going to be a salesman. That's that's another thing. I'm going to make make these guys the best plumbers, the best salesmen. Mm. They just aren't aren't going to do it. Okay. Um, Alex had had applicant tell me he doesn't like to get dirty and he refuses to get dirty, and that was that. <laughs> Allie? <laughs> how, do you, how do you do that as a plumber? Character. Okay. <laughs> there we go. I don't All right. want to be dirty. And see that well, guy, you picked the wrong profession. I'm if thinking. guys come right out, right at the very beginning and say that, it's, it's an easy, okay, I'm moving on, yeah. right? But you want to, most of the time it's not that easy. You've got to mm -hmm. pull, pull it out because right. they're, they're prepared to hide or to lie mm -hmm. and that, that kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. So you, you want to ask things, really not about plumbing, because they're prepared to talk plumbing, right. okay? So they'll them on their heels a bit. Right. So you want to come out of left field and ask them questions that either lets, you know, shuts them up or lets their hair down, mm -hmm. okay? They, they start thinking this is fun or mm -hmm. that kind of a thing. Right. And then guys, more relaxed. Right. And then guys will just it, they'll throw up on you. The interview is a little um, intimidating. Right. Right. We've all been at interviews, and they right. can be a little nerve-wracking no matter what position it is. Right. So, so I try to get, try to get them talking, mm -hmm. okay? And yeah, you do less talking. Let them talk. Right. Ask leading questions. Right. Because that will, will, character will come out. So even if, you know, things like I'm looking mm -hmm. for, are they, they start cussing. Yeah. Right away. Even though, you know, we're, we're in the trades and that kind of stuff and we're in a world with the cussing. But mm -hmm. if they're certainly cussing right in front of you, you know, certainly, mm -hmm. um, you know. A certain front of the CSR or the, the whatever female is doing the initial right. interview. That, that's, that's a character flaw. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Because this is as good as it gets, guys. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is the interview. Period. This this is not even the honey. This is the the first. This is the not even honey, this, this is the Google, googly eyed, <laughs> Twitter pated. You know, like, um, we're in. What's one of the online dating sites? You know, Christian Mingle. This is like Christian Mingle. <laughs> right. <'cause, laughs> It's the only I don't, one, know, I don't know. know. You know, this is. Only, hold on. The only reason I know Christian Mingle is because some of our good friends met on Christian Mingle and got married. So, yes. just saying. But this is the best, best, best <laughs> foot forward. Walked, you just totally bypassed well, that. <laughs> I don't know what made me think of that. I, was, <sighs> I don't want to go there. Okay. okay? All right. 
This is the first date. This is not even the first date. It's like, yeah, it's, it's, this, this is what it leads up to that first date where you know the first date's coming and you both you know want it. That where is is everything's the best and the emotion is the heightened. So if they're cussing mm -hmm. and telling you what they don't want to do and what's wrong, that kind of thing. Yeah. So I would ask questions. So um, you know why. You know, why are you looking, why did you leave your other... Yeah, but why are you looking to leave or why did right. you leave? So if they start bad-mouthing, mm -hmm. and you know it could be, but if they start, you know, the whole thing is to bad-mouth and right. that kind of thing, that's a character flaw. Character flaw. So be, because it's not going to get any better. Mm -hmm. uh, a weekend with you, you're going to be the biggest whatever. And <laughs> anyway, I mean, sure. right, okay? Mm -hmm. So I'm character looking for, matters. Character matters, mm -hmm. okay? So, Asking leading questions. Yes. And I don't know if what the next step we're going to, but all about making it part of a process. Yes. Right? Okay. Yes. Well, we'll talk about process okay. next, okay? But first, I got something for you, especially <laughs> our, our new guys here that joined us. All right? It's a new thing, okay. guys. It's, it's my Million new. Dollar Plumber Blueprint, okay? Where I lay out all the specs, okay, that you need to build yourself a successful plumbing business. It's all in there in my Million Dollar Plumber Blueprint. And a patented Million Dollar Plumber that's right and it's free okay you can't mm -hmm. beat that okay so there's no <laughs> excuse all right if you're if you're looking for uh looking for uh i guess the the, the blueprint mm -hmm. to lay out a, a you know a successful plumbing business i know it's all right there all right there and so simply free. type simply type free in the comments free. or go to the million dollar plumber.com <laughs> forward slash free all right so there we go all uh -huh. right grab okay. it all okay. Right. So what do so we? So what do we got? Number one. Number one. Okay. It's all about plumbing. It, it ain't oh, about wait, plumbing. It ain't about plumbing. Okay. When when you're hiring, it ain't about plumbing. This is one I could. <laughs> when you run a plumbing business. It ain't about plumbing. When you're going looking for customers. It ain't about plumbing. <laughs> okay. All right. Number two. All I'm right. To you. Even Sparky's pushing me along here. Is he? All right. Okay. <laughs> character matters. Okay. You want to hire on character. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Whether they can do plumbing matters. Don't I'm not not saying that. Okay, it's expected. Okay, yes. so as part of it, part of it's your responsibility. Is you know when you're looking over their their um, their application. application or whatever, and you know have they worked? Right. Ha shop. Have they worked in a plumbing <laughs> shop? Right. Okay. What kind of plumbing shop? Mm -hmm. Okay. You know. Well, so and it's, they've it's, got referrals as well. You right. Call up on our referrals. It, it, That's what it's called. What do you call it? Not referrals. Or um. What's the oh, man, what kind of... that you put on your resume? Three people that you know, blah blah blah. All right, someone help us out oh, here. See, it's cold here. <laughs> See what it's done to us. <laughs> what is the? What is that called? Okay. Oh, all right. Okay. So that happens me. when you get older too. <gasps> Stop. No, it does okay. not. Our all right. are sharp. Yeah, they are sharp. Okay. okay. <laughs> Refer. <laughs> Thank you, Sparky. <laughs> That was All a right. good one, Sparky. Okay. <laughs> a reference. Reference. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Sparky's so, yes. like our little brain. So it is your responsibility <laughs> to do your due diligence. Okay, that's another word for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Due diligence. So, you know, look over the application. So if they say they've worked at a plumbing shop, all right, and they've had a couple of plumbing shops and all that, and what, what you know, not RV repair shops or right. you know, we're a ma maintenance shops. man at wherever. Okay. Oh yeah, true. You know that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. All right, but plumbers, which is what you want to hire. Mm -hmm. Okay, you're looking, you're looking to hire plumbers, not green guys, not guys that you just want to make a better life for and just want to give a helping hand, you know, and that kind of a thing. All right, mm -hmm. you want to hire plumbers. Right. Okay, once you become established mm -hmm. and it's systemized, and you know, after at least ten trucks, then you can maybe consider bringing on a little helper guy, mm -hmm. you know, that kind green of a thing. Guy to okay, try to right, mm -hmm. maybe then. Okay. But not until then. Right. All right. All right. So we've had ain't about plumbing, mm -hmm. character matters, and finally we <laughs> have saying reference you moron. That's what right. basically. <laughs> right, right, right. Thank you. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. God. All right. Finally, Thanks, guys. the piece de resistance. <laughs> Always be recruiting. <laughs> Always be recruiting. I have something to say about that. Okay, you have something to say. I do because I know some of these things. Everybody's like. Oh, you said this before, but here's uh, the thing: we've got, I know. we've got clients too that hear this from us, and sometimes you forget and you get really comfortable <sighs> because it's easy to get comfortable because recruiting is tough, not tough. Right. It's it's cumbersome and it takes time, and you're already busy, right? So if you've got a great crew, you know, rolling right along and steaming right along, you're like, okay, 
I'm just, I'm not you get gonna, lazy. I'm not going to recruit right now because I got four thousand other things I need to work on. Right. But then there's you know, nothing more important. But nothing. It it never fails. Then right. all of a sudden, it's like it's like I say I don't need a I don't need a phone because mm-hmm. I got plenty of customers. <clears throat> huh? What? No. Okay. Always be recruiting. Never so stop. So we, we never, say never these things. You probably heard us say these very mm-hmm. right, same well, things a lot. Like it ain't about plumbing. Mm-hmm. Always be recruiting because they. They, it is that simple, okay, guys? This, this isn't difficult. It really isn't difficult. Mm-hmm. We make it difficult by not doing these things, right. okay? And one of the things is, is not recruiting, okay? Um, you must always be recruiting. In fact, you know, I, t- I tell my guys, you know, one of the concerns is, what, what, if, what am I going to do when I get out of the truck? Mm-hmm. What is it? Yeah, that's the thing. What, what, what do I, what what do, I do then? What, what am I going to do? Mm-hmm. You're always going to be recruiting. Recruit and marketing. <laughs> right. You, your job, and if, if you don't like this, Get out of the plumbing business right yeah. now and go be, be a plumber for someone, okay? It's a business. Right. It's Your business, business will be um, when you're on vacation, when you're down here with us in Florida, <laughs> or you're doing whatever, you're going to be checking on two things all the time, okay? Your marketing, mm-hmm. okay? Because that's where your customers come from. How's my marketing working? Right. Okay? And the other, um, just as important, if, if not in many ways, more important, you're recruiting. Right. Do, do we have yeah. any recruits? Do we have do we any have any any, any, any interviews? Any applicants? Whatever. Mm-hmm. Right. Always be recruiting. Mm-hmm. Well, I got a great crew. No, you don't. No, you don't. You will come in <laughs> next Monday, you, you and the half of them will be gone. <laughs> I've seen it all the time. I don't care if it's family. It's my brother. He'll never. Yeah, he will. <laughs> yeah, he will. He'll leave or you. you he'll leave him. you for a buck. <laughs> right. They, mm-hmm. Okay. It's true. I've seen it oh, year after years, guys. Mm-hmm. Years. And so I hope you feel the passion here. Okay. What's it? We care not about the word. We're, we're the pain to bring the mean potatoes. Thanks, Daryl. Uh, okay, You're all right. Very gracious. All right, right. <laughs> what, What's that word? Thank you. Right. Uh, the. Oh, we're showing yeah. her right. Uh, right. <laughs> See, if we can do it, you can do it. We can't remember the word reference. Okay. All right. Bo says, "I treat it like a hunting trip. I must hunt to live. I hunt my competitors' plumbers." Yes. Yes. And it is and your competitors' problem. I mean, right. I've had and guys. You're not stealing from you're not, them. We've had guys say, "Well, I feel like I'm stealing from." No, you're no, not. You're not. You're offering Do, them something better, hopefully. Don't you think this is professional plumbing, just mm-hmm. like pro- professional sports? They're not stealing when they get that better quarterback or that whatever. It's it's just the nature it's of the business. Business. Okay. Right. All right. Mm-hmm. And that's who you want. You mm-hmm. want the better quarterback from the other team. Mm-hmm. You don't want a guy that you got to train up from high school. Right. Or whatever, mm-hmm. just because he was, you know, what you, you want, you want the guy that's already proven himself. Right. Okay. Um, Ken says, if I can find, and find is the key, um, can you read that word, uh, new work plumber, so I'd be happy. There's no one to be found. <gasps> not true, Ken. That's not true. It's not true okay. Ken. All right. Is there, here's, and how we know that, I'm probably going to get you everywhere. Yes. Right. Um, are there other plumbing shops in your area? Right. Do they have plumbers? If they have plumbers, okay. there's plumbers. Right. Mm hmm. That, that's them. the thing. That's, that's the lie we tell ourselves. Well, it makes us feel more comfortable like it's not our fault. Mm. The fact that you can't get plumbers, it's your fault. That's accepting. I know it's hard, Ken. Mm. Uh, Ken, it's, Sorry, Ken. It's, well, accepting, it, Ken. It's, it's, it's accepting responsibility, <laughs> which is something that men in our society don't do a lot anymore today. Mm. Okay. But, Ken, but, there's an answer, just but, like Bo said, right? Go right. get the competitors. Right. Your competitors, guys. Just make a, a, um, a better work atmosphere. Make, right. Make a better place to... You're, go ahead. Blake. Well, I know. I was just saying. I always ask. I hear this. This is the this is the thing. I know yeah. I, I got a passion for this. Okay, because this is this is where the guys have the excuse, to, you know, like get them off the hook or something. Okay. okay? Yeah. But I got to ask. Always I always scary. ask guys where they can't find anyone, mm-hmm. or you know, to come work for, them. for to come work for them. Mm-hmm. Why would anyone want to work for you? I need to answer that question. You, you got to answer. Why would it, Why would anyone right. want to leave? Why that? would someone leave where they're at? Which is probably secure in their right. eyes, right? right? They've been there for a while and they know people and whatever. Why would someone want to leave to come Alexander, work for you? Alexander, I got it right, brother. It's not stealing. It's scouting. Yes, that's it a, is. That's a good way to put it. That's exactly right. Mm-hmm. Yep. All right. So create something that people want to come and work for. Right. With. Because. Just like, just like your customers. Create a plumbing company that people want to, to use you. Right. right? With, with nice trucks, with good equipment, with um, quality plumbers. Right. That's right. how you outdo your competition. Right. Not only with customers, but with plumbers as well. Because that leads to our question yes. of what plumbers are really looking for mm-hmm. in an employer. OK. And do you have the answer? Yes, I do. Ooh, all right. Okay. And some and some mm-hmm. said it. All right. Mm-hmm. They're looking for security, mm-hmm. not the most money. OK. Mm-hmm. Uh, certainly they want money. OK. Sure. 
all right? Mm-hmm. Um, not all the, the gimmies and the freebies, which mm-hmm. they'll take and like. Mm-hmm. That won't keep them there, mm-hmm. by the way. That won't PTO, keep them. PTO's big, and I don't know if Jessica's still right. there. Jessica Giambroni of Applicant yeah. Pro. PTO, that, that's mm-hmm. you know, it's big stuff and yeah. that, okay? For time off. Right. Yes. But that, because people want um, time. Right. Because time is, is um, something you can't get back. Yes. And um, if you can give, like if you gave, like typically, I think when Jessica was on, she talked about that normally you get a week after, you give a week after a year or whatever. Um, and those things are changing mm-hmm. now to where you can really give, why not give them a week right when they start? You know, yep, you've got a week. Is. It's a week. So what? Right. You know, think about what the what that dollar amount is. Do it anyway. Right. Mm-hmm. Um, healthcare, healthcare, yeah, right? That's true. Healthcare, okay. especially um, guys with families, right. right? See, and that even healthcare though goes to security. Mm-hmm. Okay, all these things, if there's not not if there's not a sense of security, these other these other things really don't matter. Right. Okay, the security is the thing. Mm-hmm. So what what makes these guys feel secure mm-hmm. is if it feels like a real business. Yes. Okay, a real business. Mm-hmm. So that's why even through this process, you want to have a process through the hiring. Mm-hmm. It's not meeting you at your truck and saying, so, you looking for a job. Right. Yeah. Tell me about the plumbing you've done. Okay, right, that right. kind of. No, yeah, it has to be a to- oh, full-on process from, right. um, from when they fill out an application through the even first initial. Even if you're one man, if it's just yes. you and a truck, okay. And through the first right. initial interview, right. right? Um, through the second interview, through the entire process, if, um, through the whole app, um, interview process, all of it, it needs to be a system because then it feels secure as opposed to, like you said, just out out in the parking lot at Taco Bell. Right. Right. Never in the parking lot. Mm-hmm. Never on the job. Mm-hmm. There's nothing about mm-hmm. that that's so secure. Right. And professional. Okay. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's, that's what they're looking for. Right. Okay. So even if it is just maybe you and your wife and you're looking for your very first plumber, right. create a process. Right. That they will go through because that'll get them secure. Right, because they're looking for, right. Looking so it has to be a process. Right. E- even in finding you, that's why I think you mentioned Applicant Pro. I okay. did mention Applicant okay. Pro. All right, if you're not using Applicant Pro, you're not serious about growing your plumbing business. App- yeah. Okay. Um, um, let's see. I think it, if you type Applicant, I think Applicant in the right. um, comments right now, you get information, free demo on Applicant Pro. But right. It's an entire system um, for um, recruiting. Right. It's, it's your whole, it's kind of your HR department. Because we're looking, we're constantly recruiting, right? Constantly recruiting. Well, so, so you, you, you want to automate that and systemize that. Yes. Okay. And Applicant Pro helps you do just that. Mm-hmm. They, they do it for you. So, and it is so affordable. So right. there's no reason why not to use Applicant Pro if you're serious, if you're truly serious about growing your plumbing business. Mm-hmm. Well, I can, I find guys on my own, but well, you're still going to find guys on your own. Sure. You, but you, you want to diversify, mm-hmm. okay, you, you know, your whole process and you want to make it of, of going after, right. right. You want, you right. Want to, again, if you're right. looking, if you're wanting to grow your plumbing business, you got to make it scalable and you got to have systems in place. Right. So Applicant Pro is one way to do that. So do it if mm-hmm. you're serious, okay. Yes. If you're not, if you're just, just looking to play around, mm-hmm. then do what you're doing. I mean, right. Right. Yeah, Applicant Pro right. takes great care of million dollar plumber um, viewers, yeah. Jessica and her team. Um, do a great job. So, and this ne- wasn't necessarily a commercial for Applicant Pro, but oh. it goes along with. No, it goes right right along um, with it. Hiring. Okay, so, right. Mm-hmm. And I made a note, note here just as yes. a reminder too. This is another place where we fall short. Mm. Um, is to interview everyone. Okay. Ooh, yeah, that's good. Interview everyone. Okay. Now, if it's a guy who says, you know, he's, you know, he's just arrived from Mars, um, <laughs> but he worked at the, you know, repairs and you know what, whatever. You don't want to. You want to have someone that's been a plumber, residential, right? Service plumber. Okay. But yes, hire right. everyone. But or but, not hire. Uh, but interview, interview everyone. Interview everyone. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. You want to make it part of where it's just second nature. Right. Okay. You want to make where it's because it's good practice for you. Right. Okay. Doesn't mean you have to hire them. Mm-hmm. Okay. But you'll never. You know. You'd be surprised who you may come across. Yes. Okay. Our worst well, interview. We've said this so many times. Our worst right. interview ended up being our best employee. Right. Um, and yeah, right. so you never know. Right. And it's because it was just the process of, I'm, I'm interviewing everyone. Right. He was a plumber, mm-hmm. but I wasn't really impressed with his, mm-hmm. his resume mm-hmm. and that kind of stuff. But right. he turned out to be our best, our best, our best guy. Mm-hmm. So good that one of the largest shop in town came in Stole. a few years later and gave him <laughs> a, a big bonus and 
stolen from us. Okay. Uh, okay, I don't want to talk about that. Okay. Um, Chris says wife Kathy just signed us up to. Oh, really? Literally walked in um, from work with her on the conference. Oh, oh good. With, okay. Um, with Applicant Pro, that's awesome. We All love right. Applicant Pro. Bo says. Good. Yep. It, it's just a good part of the process because it, it's just <laughs> it's and it's a part of the process. Ooh, okay. Good. Allie, fantastic. Okay. Allie said they did too. Love All right. That. Good. Um, Kelly good Knight says define robbing. <laughs> Uh, Kelly, not, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to define that for you, Kelly. <laughs> Especially you, Kelly. <laughs> uh, um, I interviewed the guy at the supply house counter. No. No. Alex. Okay, hey, no. he doesn't take you serious. Nope. Don't do that. Nope. It's got to be a process. Yep. I have I had Sandra, right? I think Sandra is the other half of the PPC. Right. She needs to interview first. It's yes. It's got to be a process. A and guys, process. I can tell you, I know and you. I think, yeah. I'm sorry, honey. I think, um, Alex, you guys are in the in the Success Academy, and, yeah. and that module is coming up where we walk through the entire thing. So, yeah. Um, but um, I felt that way until I learned why it was actually what it was actually cost me to run a plumbing business. Yes. Mm -hmm. So it's yeah. With I know we, we talk with guys in the field, you know, um, we you know at the supply house and that kind of stuff. But you don't want to talk hiring them in that kind of environment. Mm -hmm. They just don't take it serious. Right. Okay, I know we think we're having a relationship, and that, mm -hmm. but they and don't. it's easy because it's convenient. Because Alex, I'm yeah. pretty sure you're still in the truck, right? right. So your that your time is is valuable and time is limited. Right. But you've got to you've got to find a way to um, create the atmosphere of security. Hey, we're growing. We're always looking for you know great guys, mm -hmm. and so you know, hand the card. Say, hey, give give the office a call. We we'll get something set up. Mm -hmm. Or you have the you know. Um, linked applicant link, pro, applicant pro, which mm -hmm. does all that for you. It's all right. set up. It makes it easy for them. They mm -hmm. even run through a little test, so you can run through a little knowledge base. Mm -hmm. You know, just to make sure, you know what they can and can't do. You right. can do that. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Was well, well, as well like as other questions, paperwork, right? Everything. Yeah, you can go through pre-screening. You know, it's amazing. But it's right. the entire HR department, they take care of it for okay. you. Okay, and mm -hmm. so it was part of my process too. You know, I had other cards that just had. Um, um, our um, address, our number, or whatever, and something that said, you know, we're always hiring, mm -hmm. always looking for a good, number. few good mm -hmm. men, that mm -hmm. kind of a thing. All right, so I would go out, um, you know, at the Taco Bell at lunchtime. That was an excuse to go to Taco right? Bell. Don't let him fool you. Right. <laughs> But I'd walk up to the guys, you know, a couple guys that work with other plumbing companies and say, hey, hey, we're always looking for good guys, always looking for good guys. And I'd walk away. Okay, they're not prepared to talk right, you right then. You plop and, down and okay. start interviewing them right Did then. some of the guys throw the card away? Yeah. Probs. But they remembered. It was all part of that, it's all part of that process and other things that we can do, okay, right. that, that, that uh, remind them, okay, that, or build a culture that you're always hiring. Mm -hmm. But it was just always another recruiting. step, always, always recruiting, mm -hmm. right. And so the other guys did hold on the cards. Even the guys didn't hold on the cards remembered mm -hmm. that Attaboy Plumbing was hiring. Right. Attaboy always always looking for good guys. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so when they finally got tired of where they're at, and these guys are already working, you want to you wanna hire guys that are already working. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. Alex, it's still in the truck. We're trying to spend more time behind the desk working on the business. And we know that's tough. Al yeah, that's, it is tough. tough you're, is. you're in the championship rounds, yep. brother. Mm -hmm. Just keep with it. Okay. Yep. Keep with it. Okay. Don't, don't, don't give in. The that's how you know you'll, you'll succeed if you don't stop. Right. Just you don't, just, just don't just stop. stop. Okay. You just keep going. Hit in the face, you get back up. Get back up. That's mm -hmm. right. That's right. Just like Rocky says. Right. Mm-hmm. What does Rocky say? I don't know. I don't either. Joe Adrian. <laughs> 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 oh, but there uh, we have it, guys. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. The hiring is that mm -hmm. simple. Mm -hmm. Okay. It is that simple. And important. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. And it's a constant. So it ain't about plumbing. Mm -hmm. Okay. It ain't about plumbing. I can't, I can't stress that enough. Okay. It ain't about plumbing. Don't mm -hmm. get caught up in the plumbing thing. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Character matters most. Okay. Yes. If they say that, you know, you want to be looking at guys that are already working somewhere, have plumbing experience, service experience, mm -hmm. okay, be best, okay, that kind of a thing. But you're going to hire on character. Character matters most, mm -hmm. okay? And finally, always be recruiting. <laughs> Don't stop. Always be Don't, recruiting. Until the day you sell your plumbing business. Always be <laughs> recruiting, yep. okay? Always be, you, I, I guarantee on to you, if you stop recruiting, one day you're going to come in and you're going to remember what your big brother, the million dollar plumber, said, and you're going to be crying because <laughs> you're going to he come was in. Right. Right. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. Don't worry about what the others are doing. Focus on your, your own. own bobber. Your own bobber. Way to play. I love it. Bobber. What yeah. does that mean? The, the fishing. Oh. I like the fishing analogy. <laughs> That's right. Focus on your own stuff. Mm hmm.
Okay. Good analogy. All right. Mm. So always. Because your own power might be all of a sudden you got a fish. Right. right. And then you missed it. Okay. Right. See, okay. I catch on. All right. So always be recruiting. Okay. Okay. There so we go. So this was the part one of our four part series. Right. So. We'll, we'll, you got to come back next week. All right. We'll get into the, tra- the training this thing. <laughs> you see me go off the deep end on that one. <laughs> I mean, guys are spending years training guys. And, <laughs> anyway. Don't give it away. Okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, it, okay. It'll be a super. Um... And wait till we get to firing. My favorite part. <laughs> no, that one is a little bit more fun. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, not really. But... All right. So there we have it. Hey, okay. if, you, if you want to learn more about this subject, mm-hmm. you know, hiring and many other subjects that are very important to your plumbing business, Mm -hmm. then you need to check out my Million Dollar Plumber Success Academy. Look, you didn't learn plumbing in a day, okay? Okay? And you're not going to learn business in a a day, all right? 95% of all plumbing businesses fail, not because they're not good plumbers, okay? You're, You're the best plumbers, not that you don't love your customers, okay? I know you love your customers. All right, but they don't understand the business of plumbing. All right, and in the Success Academy, we teach everything business of plumbing. Okay, and it's all some. in there for you. All right, mm-hmm. and you can check it out for free right now. Fourteen day free trial. Mm-hmm. Simply type success in the comments, or go to themilliondollarplumber dot com forward slash success. Check it out. Okay, Yay. all right, and get mm-hmm. serious in twenty twenty one with growing your plumbing business. All right, there we okay. go. Okay. Thanks, babe. It ain't about plumbing. (laughs) All right. And as always, I also want to remind you that you were purposely and wonderfully created and you were created to do great things. So get out there and plumb like a champion. Thank you for tuning in to Potty Talk Live with Richard Bainey, the million dollar plumber. If you enjoyed this show, share it now. Just do it. To catch past episodes and get alerts for new episodes, turn notifications on now. And join us again for more tips, techniques, and strategies to help you grow your plumbing business.